So, a marriage made in heaven. What do I mean by that in photographic terms? Well, what I mean is the combination of camera, lens and any other ancillary equipment. Because if those are correct, it truly is a marriage made in heaven. Now, I really enjoy macro photography. And the combination that I use for that may surprise you. It is the GH5 Mark II camera to start with. Now this camera is often regarded as a video-centric camera, which indeed it is. In fact, for the money, you'd be hard pressed to find anything that's better. However, it has a 20 megapixel sensor, which is fantastic for macro photography. I remember not so long ago when if you had a camera with 10 megapixel sensor, you thought you had a camera that was the bee's knees. Now I've combined this with the Olympus F 2.8 Zuiko macro lens, an absolutely wonderfully sharp lens that is so easy to use and in combination with the GH5 Mark II camera is a combination that really for me works very well. I've also combined that with a Meke ring flash and I'll explain the reasons for that in a short while. Macro photography comes in two basic styles. Firstly, you can have a style which is indoors where the setup is perfect, i.e. you've got the proper lighting, tripods, equipment, etc. And the GH5 Mark II is perfect for that because it allows you to focus stack the images that you take. The GH5 Mark II will automatically take images at different focal lengths and then internally combine them into a single image where the depth of field is as much as you want to uh, have for the particular image or subject that you've chosen. And that's all fine and dandy. The problem arises when you try to do macro photography outside because the technique means that you have to, generally speaking, move the camera backwards and forwards without a tripod and with particularly if you've got an insect in a hedgerow, low light. Hence, the Meke flash system, which allows you to do that and achieve that situation with plenty of light. The combination is also quite light, especially as I've combined my particular rig with a Coleman mini tripod. Now, what this allows you to do is to have a very firm grip on the camera when you're moving it in and out of the subject to get the desired effect that you want, which is when you combine the images to have a finished image which has focus from the very front of the image to as far back in the field as you wish to achieve for your particular purposes. Now, the camera system that I used to use before, the D500 from Nikon and the Tokina 100 f2.8 pro macro lens is here and it's a fantastic combination and brilliant the problem is it's so heavy and when you've been doing this for a few minutes you find that your arms start to ache and that's a catastrophe in macro photography because what happens is you start to shake and unfortunately even with a flash that shake is noticeable in the final image and you have something which is indeed unacceptable. So I can highly recommend the combination of the GH2, of the Olympus f2.8 60mm macro lens and the Meke flash ring. A marvellous combination and I heartily recommend it. Now as my old mum used to say the proof of the pudding of course is in the eating. So what follows are a series of images that I've taken over the past year. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoy the images. If you want to know more about the techniques that I use and how I achieve the results that I do, the software that I use for stitching the images together for example, then please leave me a comment below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching, have a great day.